Hi, I'm Melissa Francis and welcome to Timeless Creations. Today what we're doing is a clipped up ephemera banner. Ephemera is hot and banners are hot and we're going to combine the two. What I'd like to show you is this really cute little banner that I've created. And these are our new, uh, uh, we call them uh, connectors. And they're really cool, they're made out of metal. And I'll show you on this one. And what they do, what they are, is just a really f uh, pretty little metal clip, and uh, it has two little uh, connectors. So you can actually connect and do all kinds of things like this. You could put all these little banners together, and you can clip it onto a curtain or all kinds of things. But right now, we're going to show you how to make it. Yay! So the first thing you want to do is you want to get a cutting mat because we are going to take our chipboard that we have. This is our label style chipboard. And what you want to do is you want to cut it perfectly in half. So you want to take your um, X-Acto knife, and remember safety, always keep the lid on. And we're going to just uh, line it up so that the points come, and we're just going to cut that in half. And for timing, yay, lo and behold, I've already done it for you. <laughs> so now we've cut it in half. And with the one, uh, the banner that we did here, we used actually as probably our best selling paper that we've ever had. It's called Jewel, and it actually comes from our Fifth Avenue line. And it's absolutely beautiful. And it's just a collage of really pretty um, ephemera and Victorian uh, images. And oh, I just love it because it's also very shabby chic. Now, we're just going to take the paper and you're just going to put it over the chipboard and then again, you're just going to take your knife and you're just going to trim off the excess so that you have like this. Now, you're going to do it times three, so you're going to do three. You'll have one left over. Why not use it as a mini book cover? You can always punch a couple holes and use it as a mini book cover. But right now, we're doing a banner. So this is our banner. And now, ephemera. I'm always asked, what is ephemera? Ephemera is actually, it's paper that was only ever meant to be used once. So like a train ticket, a bus ticket, or movie ticket, that kind of stuff. It was meant to be thrown away or disposed of, but not for us. We like to dig for it and find it and use it. So we came up at Melissa Francis, we came up with this really cute little ephemera kit. And you can see we have this really pretty uh, chipboard and a little doily. We all love um, doilies, they're really cute. And some pearls, and these pearls, I've been told constantly how fabulous our pearls are, so it's always nice to hear. And some postcards, and this is a really cute little, little flip book, kind of opens up, it's a little lady in her sexy lingerie. And um, again, like a ticket, and then we have some Victorian kid images, which are really cute. Uh, some really nice pretty ribbons, twines, and some um, flowers. So all I did was just take all these images and just kind of layer them down on the banner. Very simple. It seems difficult, but it's not. The one thing with our die cuts right here, you'll see that there's a white line around the outside. And uh, you can always come in and cut it closer. Or if you want, you can just kind of, which I did on the banner, I did go in and cut it. But if you're not into doing like really precision cutting, you can actually just ink it like this. And it kind of gives it more of that kind of vintage look as well. And you're not having to waste that time on cutting straight. So you can see it's just kind of completely uh, taken away that white image. And all you're going to do is you can cut them to the sizes um, that you've seen. If you look at our um, banner that I've done, I've cut down and just kind of layered. Also, if you're so lucky to go antiquing, I did actually include some real antique postcards. Some of them are like 10, 15, 20 dollars, but if you look, some of them are not so nice and the vendors sell them for a dollar or two. But I'm not looking for the front side, I'm looking for the back side. And the back side is where it has all this great script and great writing and all these really pretty stamps. So as you can see, I just want to show you on this one right here. I actually just took a postcard as my background and I just cut it in half. Then I took the leftover image and just used um, a corner punch and just did a long strip. And again, this is just another piece out of an old book and I just layered it with some buttons. So all you're simply doing is taking your postcards, you're taking your like little images like this and you're just adding flowers. And if you want, you can even just definitely, you want to ink up the doily. And you're going to put the doily in the back like that. And just more is more. 
and add some more when it comes to the ephemera look. And it's just a beautiful banner that you can hang up in your office. To me, I love it because it gives me a lot of inspiration. And I just want to thank you very much for taking your time and coming and visiting me at Timeless Creations.